This is a video tutorial on how to find information on companies. We'll work through the How to Find Company Information flowchart that can be found on the Business Information Services website. The web address is www.library.illinois.edu slash BIS. Once on the web page, look under the search bar for the heading that says Research Navigation, and from there select How to Find Company Information, which will bring up a helpful flowchart PDF. Most of the resources on this flowchart are databases that the university library has paid for. You must be associated with the university or on campus to access these resources. Also make sure your computer has Adobe Reader installed so you can open PDF files. In this video, we will search for information about private companies. To learn how to find information on subsidiary and public companies, see our other videos. We will start at the top of the flowchart in the box that says, Determine if the company is public, private, or subsidiary. First, let's try to find information for Jimmy John's, a company headquartered in Champaign-Urbana. In this video, we will only look at a few resources. However, when conducting your own research, you should explore the other databases in order to gain a fuller view of your company. Let's check in Hoover's Academic Pro, which we access through Mergent Databases. Click on the Mergent Databases link. If you're accessing this off-campus, this is where you will enter your University of Illinois username and password to continue. Click Continue to enter the database. Select Companies in the search bar and type in Jimmy John's. A selection of options will pop up. Select the top one located in Champaign, Illinois. This will bring up a company overview. Under Key Information in the middle of the page, we can see that the company type is private. Hoover sometimes has financial information on companies, which can be found by clicking the Financial tab at the top. But when we look through, there is no actual information which often happens with private companies because they are not required to release their financials to stockholders like public companies are. To find financials on Jimmy John's, we will have to look elsewhere. Let's go back to the flowchart to see the next step. Since the company is private, we'll follow the private arrow down to the box labeled Consult Sources Below for Information About Private Companies. Let's use the Privco database this time. Click on the link and then on the Databases link to enter Privco. If you don't already have a free Privco account, you will need to sign up for one before you continue, using your Illinois email address. Then you can choose your own password. Once you've done that, you can sign in. Now that we're in the database, type the name of the company into the search box in the upper right. The result is for Jimmy John's Franchise LLC, which is the one we want. In the company profile, we can see basic information, such as company financials and graphs representing the financial data. At the bottom, there is also mergers and acquisitions activity. If we look back at the flowchart, it says to check in article databases for information as well. For many private companies, news articles are a good source of information and sometimes the only place to find certain information when private companies do not choose to share much. We'll look at Nexus Uni, which is used mainly for articles, but also has company information and content related to legal issues. Click on the link, then the LexisNexis databases link. For articles, make sure News is selected, and under Search All News For, enter Jimmy John's in quotation marks. The quotation marks will only search for that specific phrase. Then press the blue search button. From the list of results, you can narrow things down by searching within the results by using the search box in the upper left or using the facets on the left. If we select publication types, we can narrow the search results to just newspapers, which will only bring up articles related to Jimmy John's. So now we know a little about how to find information for private companies. We'll continue working through the flowchart and focus on subsidiaries next. If you have any questions about this process, contact the Business Information Services team.